This is a grisly type of injury when you see this sort of stuff. Dr. Mauricio Heilbronn is a trauma and vascular surgeon at St. Mary Medical Center in Long Beach. He sees many car crash injuries like those suffered by Tiger Woods, where the leg bone is broken in several places and pierces the skin. He says this poses an increased risk of infection. Heilbronn says the fact that doctors had to relieve pressure in Wood's leg by surgically releasing the covering on the muscle is a complication that could delay his recovery. Now it's how fast will the swelling go down and enable us to close the wound. The golf legend's leg is now stabilized by a rod and his ankle held together by pins and screws. But Dr. Heilbronn says while he should be able to walk without assistance after physical therapy, which could take several months, it's Wood's five previous back surgeries that pose the biggest threat to him recovering enough to make a full comeback as a golf pro. When you're dealing with the intricacies of a golf swing and the legs and the power that comes from your back and your legs and the way you transfer, he's gonna be, he has a leg that either he's pushing off of or landing on. And the rotational part, which is all back, that's already injured. Dr. Heilbronn says mental and emotional health are also big factors in determining whether people recover from these type of injuries. People who think they're gonna do better, do better. People who think they're gonna do worse, do worse. I don't care what the injury is. As an elite athlete, Tiger Woods has repeatedly shown us he can overcome major obstacles. I wouldn't bet against Tiger Woods. Angie Crouch, NBC4 News.